Hi, folks. I'm Bob Shaw, physical therapist. Brad Heineck, physical therapist. And together, we are the most famous physical therapists on the internet. In our opinion, of course. Bob. I have no idea. What did you, what did you just say? You'll experience it someday, Bob, and there will be no end to it. You'll right. get you when you're surprised. Okay, today we're going to talk about the fastest neck stretch to stop pain from mm. the levator scapula. Now, that's an interesting muscle, isn't it, Brad? Right, and the name, the levator. I always remember the levator scapulator. Oh, cool. When I was in school to try and memorize the 472,000 muscles in your body or whatever it is. Yeah, we always had a joke when we would leave the room. We'd say, see you levator. <laughs> Man, that's the kind of humor you start doing when you've yeah. been studying day and night yeah, for exactly. many times. So, anyways, let's, let's show where the muscle yeah, is, Brad. The muscle is uh, here. Let's get uh, uh, Napoleon. Napoleon out. You're, you're going to see the back side of Gumby. So we normally don't show that side, but that's all right. <laughs> well, we okay. got to be closer, I bet. How is that? Okay, we got our restraining order. She has against us. She doesn't let us get any closer. Right. So he, this blue tape represents the levator scapula. So okay. just like the name says scapula, you can imagine it attaches to the, the scapula, the shoulder blade here, and then it connects up to uh, C2, 3, and 4, the transverse process of those three vertebra. And when the muscle contracts, its primary uh, job is to elevate the scapula. Now, we can't show that on Leopold because... Yeah. Or Napoleon. Napoleon. <laughs> sorry. Bone apart. Bone apart, yeah, because the way it's uh, put together. Um, but we're going to get a... So if this part is fixed, though, then it's going to turn the neck. Right, so. right. So it does a little component of neck rotation and maybe a little side bending, but primarily it's usually in with this. And what happens with this muscle, it's a postural muscle, it's a flat muscle. It's not made for a lot of work, but it can tighten up and you can get a knot in that muscle. And it happens a lot if you have poor posture. Say you're working at a computer, looking at your cell phone a lot, and that muscle's working to pull that up and you get this posture or stress and this is you know if you're all stressed out all the time or you know your 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 kids it's midnight and they had 11 o'clock curfew and you're wondering where they are right and, you know and you're getting all stressed Been down out. that road many times <laughs> so i mean yeah i mean you can feel it right in here and, and that's where often you get that knot right don't you right so, so. we need a way to uh, learn a way to stretch this out and that's exactly what we're going to show you but bob just wait there are 372 people out there waiting napoleon you see him there. by the way if you're new to our channel please take a second to subscribe to us we provide videos how to stay healthy fit pain-free and we upload every day also, if you haven't already, please go over to Facebook and like us, because right now the only people, the only person that likes us is Napoleon. Yeah. We're trying to turn things around. Right. So, so, all right. Sorry, but we're done with you now. So. All right. So we're gonna show how to stretch this muscle, huh, Hey, Brent? let's go for it. So this is my favorite way to do it. I remember uh, my first year out of school and uh, as a therapist, I worked with a woman and I showed her the stretch in the office it was bothering her mm -hmm. and she just loved it so much she was going around to everyone else in the office she, you got to learn <laughs> to stretch it's worth some wonders um so it can be really a wonderful stretch if you got some tightness one thing about this bob and i think you'll agree if you're having neck pain and you're having pain and symptoms down in your arm this is probably not the stretch no to do. this is when you the pain is localized up to, into this area maybe some of that like you were mentioning you're getting tension from stress yeah, yeah. Uh, this is a great Stress reliever, right? The stretch. So That's in the quite chair, a mouthful, by the way, stress yeah. reliever stretch. Yeah, we got to get a speech therapist. <laughs> Bob's daughter is going to come and help yeah. us out. That's what she does. In a chair, if you got your office chair like this and your left side is tight, you're going to grab the chair right here, and we're going to lean this direction. Now, what that butt does is it pulls the scapula down, and we put it into end range and locks it into place. Okay, so as you lean, you have to relax so the shoulder. So when he says scapula again, he means shoulder blade. It's pulling the shoulder blade down, locking it into place, anchoring it. Right. So if you want to see so. it from the back, you can see I, I try to relax it, and I'm holding down here, and I can feel when it's at the end. Oh, yeah, I can feel yeah. it already. Now, actually, I'm going to go the other direction, same thing. Now, this pocket right here, I always tell my patients, now, once you get to the end, look down as if you're trying to look into your pocket to see if there's a hundred dollar bill in there okay and then if you can't see it you gently take with your fingertips right on the top of your head gently add a little more pressure now this is a thin muscle it's not a real right. big bulky so you're not going to grab your head yeah, don't and pull go nuts on, on this one right this could be tough the the key to this is relax breathe relax breathe in oh, yeah, exhale remember, breathe yep 
And typically, and this is what I always tell my patients, when you exhale, just think of being relaxed, and that's when you get a little extra stress or, pre or force on the stretch. But again, not real hard. Just allow it to relax and stretch. Don't force it. So it's a whole mind thing. And if you relax and allow it to stretch, it's going to happen wonderfully. And I can feel mine stretching really nicely right now. And you now. do both sides, Brad? Oh, yes, you can. Uh, but oftentimes one side is, is more than the other. A troublemaker. So you'll emphasize on that. It actually does feel really good. It does, Bob. I'm going to go to my other side now. Yeah, go, yeah, look down for that $100 bill. You got one in there? a little crack in there, too. Oh, yeah, you may cavitate. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is, uh, that $100 bill was gone a long time yeah. ago. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, when the kids went to college yeah, or even before. Yeah, when the kids went to college and <laughs> the wife went to shopping. You're right. <laughs> Okay, so for the duration, how long are you going to hold it? I like to say between 10 seconds to 30 seconds, and it depends on how it's feeling. It's an individual thing. You're doing it wrong, Brad. You didn't look down in your pocket. Oh, I, I knew there was no money in there, so I wasn't <laughs> concerned. Um, and again, both sides is always a good idea, but really focus on the side. And you'll know, because like Bob just you know mentioned, it feels much better when you're done. Right. Okay. All right, now we're going to show some augmentive stretches. Yeah, if you want to augment or yeah. actually make this even a better stretch, I'm going to start with this. The back knob. The back knob, or you can or use thera the theracane. Yeah. Or you can take a hook cane. Just, you know, that'll work as well. This works a little bit better. They make a variety of these. We've got these listed in our products below in our Amazon yep, section. Our, our favorite. Yeah, uh, our favorite products. Yep, so you know you're going to get what you need. What you need. And I'm going to go right. I'm not going to get it high on the muscle. I'm going to no, usually get you're going to lower. Want to be low on this one. Okay, yeah. so if if we got one more time, this this will make them feel better. Yeah. We're, we're not going to get up in here. No, it's kind of hard on the spine. Yeah. We're going to get yeah. right down where it connects, and that's where the knot usually is. Kind of meaty there. Yep. Meaty, more a lot more. Right muscle. above that bone, and you can feel it. You'll yeah. know when you get there with your with your device your there. Back knobber or theracane. And I'm going to work on that. And this I'm going to hold, again, 15, 20, up to 30 seconds. And by that time, you should feel it relax. And like, Bob, you like to do I always like to do it with movement. I think you can go, do, ahead, go ahead and, and do it with a stretch. You know, get into that area. And I, I'd, I'd go ahead and even work it a little bit like sure. this. And then I'd even look down a little bit. And do a little rotation. Yep. 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 Without a doubt. I, I just think it just seems to get better results that way. All right, then we have another product here we're big fans of. So, if, well, let's, let's go back. After you get done using this for a minute or so, then you repeat the stretch. Oh, sure. The, the same stretch we initially went over. Uh, another tool that works good, and, you know, Bob and I are big fans of the Pure Wave Massager because of its uniqueness. It percusses. It goes actually in and out versus a small amount of vibration. Well, so if you want to make somebody really happy for this upcoming Christmas, Buy them a pure wave. Right. If, I, don't, I don't know of anybody that wouldn't like to have one of these. If, if someone's complaining of tight muscles in their shoulder, their hamstring, their calf, or anywhere, this is a... <laughs> I got one for my sister. She works at a computer, and uh, she, you know, she... At, at, when you're a physical therapist, you get lots of calls and emails about, what can I do about my pain? I'm just like, watch our video, and I sent her one of these. <laughs> I was like... Yeah. Okay, so this one has different heads. This one is a, a pointy head. You can get into muscle uh, pretty deep with that. Again, this muscle is a small, thin muscle. We're going to put the air cushion one yeah, on there. It's I, soft. I would think that'd be a little bit too aggressive to have the point, uh, you know. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. So, ooh. The air cushion is <laughs> Yep. There. And you can, this is, you know, it's got a nice handle. You can get right to that area. One thing about this, because it is powerful, typically you're not going to go up on your neck because it's not comfortable. Gonna, How it, is it with the air cushion though? Is it all right with that? No. It no. Still rattles yeah, you, it still rattles. Yeah. When you get up in the neck, it's pretty aggressive. It kind of rattles your jaw. Yeah. Kinda. Yeah. It, yeah. And you get down here. And, you know, it's like when you're a kid, you know, and you're talking to the fan, but right, uh, yeah, yeah. you can do that kind of thing. But, oh, but that's not really going to help that muscle. But I'm going to get right on that muscle. And boy, it feels good, Bob. I'm kind of having fun. And well, you're going to do that for. If you real high onto the head, it would almost probably sound hitting like an empty drum. <laughs> Why, Bob? Little humor. Why? Little humor. Why? Trying to keep things light here. Well, I'm just going to keep working it for a little bit. And you're going to do this 30 seconds to a minute. All right. And while he's talking, the other thing you can try is you can put some heat on there. Um, you can take a heating pad. We also like the Thermatex. This is a, a, a lot more expensive. Ooh. It's infrared heat. Um, but you, and this isn't probably the one I would use. This one's actually made for the knee. But there's the platinum model. 
And, and you can just, what well, Brad and I, we, we just had this discussion. What we do is we keep the platinum model uh, right in our chairs. Mm -hmm. And then we just go ahead and we lean up against it at night. And it good, it's good for back pain or- We don't uh, just lean, we sit there in yeah, the recliner. Yeah, we sit there. And it also goes up over the shoulder right. here. And the, and the Thermatex, because it's infrared, it penetrates very deep. Right. Um, it, two point, two point three six inches. Oh, you remembered this time. Versus one to two uh, centimeters. Millimeters. Millimeter. Yeah. Right. It's, so it's, this, it, it goes this deep versus this deep. It's uh, versus, about ten times deeper than just a hot pack. Yeah. So it gets way down into right. that muscle. And, and, and then once you get done with the hot pack or the, or the Thermatex, again, finish up with the stretch like we had mentioned look down for that hundred dollar bill after you get the the scapula the shoulder blade down and you're leaning over you can see a quarter in your pocket brad yeah <laughs> i'm happy with a quarter you All better right. believe it <laughs> thanks everybody for watching take care